My name is Sinclair Skinner. The uh, name of the organization is 1911 United, and we recruit volunteers for Barack Obama's re-election. As a super PAC, we can explicitly campaign for our, the best president America's ever had. We can have a bus with President Obama's face on it. We can have literature that explicitly says, vote for President Obama. That was a, the, the, the reason why we did this. And our, the, the, the resource that we're depending on is the, the incredible people who volunteer and help make this movement possible. We try to quantify so many things, and of course money is one of those things, but when you have the ability to harness the power of some of the most, the brightest and best people in the generation that we've ever seen in America and get them to focus on doing something like re-elect this president, you know, it's hard. They can spend money on buying campaigns, but it's hard to hate people into voting a certain way. What we're doing is it's more sustainable. We're able to organize folks on have a very specific goal, but at, after Obama's reelected, these folks are empowered to do more things that continue this level of activism. So our focus is utilizing this moment to get our president reelected. It also gives us an opportunity to build a base of folks who are going to be engaged in this political activity in their own community beyond Obama. And if you looked at the numbers of blacks who voted in 2008 that didn't vote in 2004 and didn't vote in 2010 in those battleground states, the numbers are around 800 and some thousand people, meaning that we've done this before. It's not like this is an impossible mission that we're not sure we can do. We know we can beat the GOP. We've done it before. But they didn't, people didn't come out in 2010. We need those same people to come out. So we're organizing, mobilizing volunteers that have, who, who already are registered. Now we're saying you need to do a little bit more. And as a community, black folks are maturing politically. So you're going to see more engagement. And that engagement hopefully manifests itself into not just electing presidents, but be able to set an agenda and set you know, terms that improve the quality of life of other people. Whatever the political landscape looks like, we need to make sure we're doing everything we can with the resources we have available to move our agenda forward. And I think uh, if you see folks using money to put hate ads out that attack people, again, I think as an American, I, I, that's unacceptable to me. So I'm gonna make sure we use this system to empower people, to uplift people, and make people feel better about themselves and this incredible country. So that's our focus. So again, if that means we're, we're deal, dealing with the super PAC mentality or how people perceive it, that's secondary. Our, our primary objective is that, that we love this wonderful country, we love our wonderful president, and we have so much work to do, and we're gonna use every resource available to make sure it happens.